Hey dogs, welcome back to my let's play. Um, today we will be going out of diminished woods and um going around the place. Yeah. Um, I don't really know what happens next. You know, I played the whole game, but I forgot like what happens next. You know, just what I like I just said. And um, but first I have to show you. That we get a piece of heart. You completed a new heart container. Your life energy has been replenished and increased. So now we have five stars. I mean, not five stars, but five hearts. Yay! So now let's leave the village. La 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 la. I hope it's not a blockage over here. And what do you know? It's a blockage. We sneak our poco blooms to areas near where the humans live. Just having some of it makes you incredibly lucky. We're preparing it for our we're preparing for our next delivery right now. But why in front of here? Why? And you're like the only person working. So that's really dumb. But anyway. So what we're supposed to do is go to the elder, you know, and we talk to him. So you have found the earth element. You are blessed with much courage and strength for one so young. If your conviction holds strong, head to Mal Crenel. There you will find a man named Melari. Among all the minish, there is no one more able to repair your sword. If you ask him, I am certain he will reforge your broken Picori blade. I shall send you word to him in advance. Travel safely. You are brave, but there are many evils now in the world. Whoa! Leave through this door here. It will take you out of the forest quickly. Great elder, we are in your debt. You, we shall head for Mount Carmel at once. So now we're leaving through this part. So first, let's go in here to see what this dude wants. Green clothes and a mystical hat. Sir, would you by chance be Angle, the one who found the earth element? Man, word around the town spreads quickly. Surely you are. I have heard so many tales about you. Tales? We just got it. But anyway, I am Balari, researcher of antiques. I am also, well, a bit of an inventor. You know, you won't be able to get back to town due to all the debris. Here, I have something that might come in handy. You got bomb bag. It has 10 bombs in it. Now you can blow up lots of stuff. So now, let's get big. And now, let's pull out our bombs. And waste them all. I'm wasting all my bombs. Oh, you can only throw up... You can only use three at a time. So, I'm just wasting all of my bombs. Like a foolish child I am. Wow, I can blow up so much stuff. Wow. Well, basically, you just go on these bushes and you find five bombs. Oh, my God. Why? Please don't tell me. There's no bombs. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'll be back, guys. I'll be back. Finally, I found some. You get five bombs. Store them in your bomb bag. Let me see if I can find five more. So, yep, found five more. What? Oh my god. Well, now we got nine. Who cares? So anyway, we're going to use this bomb to blow up this area over here. Blew up effect 
Well, you guys already heard it, so I don't know why I just said that. But anyway. Uh, should we go here now? I forgot what's over here. I never did this in a long time. Pull it to your face, gets red and fly. Okay, let's see what this dude got. Hey, look at this kinstone piece. Have you ever seen one like this? Well, you don't know what a kinstone piece is? Well, I'll tell you what. Why don't you come back and see me when you get one, okay? I wonder how Link doesn't know what a kinstone piece is. I mean, he's been living in that... I spoiled some of it, didn't I? Well, I'm done. Anyway, I'll tell you guys later what I was just about to say. Anyway, let's continue. Let's use our bomb. I don't know why I just switched to my shield. I'm so dumb. Anyway. You blow this up. And you find. It's a chest. You get shells again. Wow. Anyway, there's a new enemy over here. So, let's active. Yeah, it's right here. It will run towards you. Well, actually try to tackle you. Then you just like hit it, I guess. And for these enemies right here, I don't know what they're called. But basically, you just use your gust jar to suck them in. And spit them out. Patooey. Patooey. There's another one of those things over here. So let's show if you just randomly just like, oh, I want to explore the forest. Not the forest, but. Oh, I killed it. Well, that was a bad example. Anyway, let's go forward. So let's blow this up so we don't have to worry about it later. Blow up effect sound. Kill them. I don't know why I'm killing them. I could just go in the village. South Hyrule Field. This is where I live. I wonder where... Like, why is the town so small? Well, you know, I'm a bad Let's Player. Why would I say stuff before we even looked around? Okay, that's some advice to myself. Come on, come on. See how many canstone pieces you can collect. Never know what's fusing canstones will do, but it's sure to be good. Come on up and get your free canstone bag for holding your canstone pieces. Don't miss out on this incredible once in a lifetime opportunity. Yes, yes, you're here for your free canstone bag, aren't you? That's right, maybe you didn't hear me, but they're free for all kids right now. You got a canstone bag. You can now carry canstone pieces with you. Who cares? Fitting two canstone pieces together is called canstone fusion. If you get two pieces to fit perfectly, great happiness will come your way. I'll put a canstone piece in your canstone bag so you can give it a try. Anyone who's ready and willing to fuse canstones can well look like I do right now. When you see that look in their eyes, and that's when you press L. I don't know what L is. I'm just a kid that doesn't know what you're talking about. Use D-pad to choose a canstone piece, and press A to try fusing it. Did you catch all of that? No, what did you say again? No, I don't want to do it again. Then stand in front of me and press L so we can fuse canstones. So, get away from me. Why are you all surrounding me? Why can't I just get out of my way? Oh my god. Fusing canstones is a blast. We're gonna fuse canstones. Fun to fuse canstones? No! Just let me go! Okay, they just forced me. Let me just talk to you. Hey, what's wrong? Press L so we could try fusing our canstone. So you won't let me get out of the way either. Well, okay. Yes, yes, that's it. Press L. Then you can see the canstone screen. The two canstone pieces fit perfectly. Maybe something good will happen. I don't know how Link can see this, but okay. 
and it's on this map too for some reason. A perfect fit. That means we're both due for a little happiness. See ya. Okay, thank you for surrounding me. So, let's go in here, see what he has to say. This dude in this house. Oh, it's not a house. It kind of looks like a cabin, but I, I, I didn't know that. Anyway, I am Swiftblade, finest swordsman in all of Hyrule. If you train with me, I guarantee that you will increase your skill dramatically. So, would you like to train here? No. No, nah, please, please. We shall start with the most basic of all techniques. I shall teach you the spinner talk. First press and hold your sword button. Second, build up from up power. Release your destructive mind. That's all, young swordsman. Do you understand? Nah, explain it to me again. You know, I feel too lazy to press these buttons, so I'm just gonna press yes. Haha, ha, very good. You are a very quick student. But one must feel the technique. That's what it's all about. That's why I now possess your body. So I have to demonstrate the technique. Did I give you permission? No. So why are you possessing my body? I call the swift blade. I call this the swift blade possession technique of training. Watch this. Possession. Get out of my body. Please. Phew, now you must try for yourself. Press and hold your sword button, build up enough power, then release your destructive might. That's all it is to it. I just want to leave. Oh, that's what happens when you leave? So I can't do it? I gotta read all this over again. Oh my god. Please. Come on. Okay, alright. Yep, I understand that. And, um, yep, and possess my body again. Even though I, I never gave you permission, but okay. Um. Yep, yep, okay, and yeah, and um. What if you hold up too much power of the power? Hmm. I'm not funny. Let's go. <coughs> yes, fine work. You're a quick study. Now I'll give you this tiger scroll. Why does it have to be a tiger? I don't know. But let's continue. If you ever forget this technique, you can review it with this scroll. You may view it any time from the quest status screen. You learned the secret spin attack fighting technique. It is the first sword technique you've learned from Master Swift Blade. Okay. Alright. See you soon. Uh, what else do we have here? Let's see what they have in this shop. I want to buy a shield. The same one that I have. Only 40 rubies for a shield. You won't find a better deal. Oh my god, yes! It's a good deal! You already have a fine shield. Honestly, who needs two shields? Oh my god. Bro, just let me buy it. Oh my god. Why are you forcing me to not buy it? If I just want two shields. Don't you want to make your money? Anyway, let's see. Ah, yes. Welcome. I dropped it. Oh, my God. Let's see. Only 80 rubies for a wallet. Oh, I got 78. Okay, I can just get two. It can only hold a king's ransom for rubies. Will you buy it? I'll buy it. Why don't you bother shop? Why do you bother shopping if you're not gonna have enough rubies? Well, you have more money. Perhaps we can discuss this further. Oh my God! Just give me a discount. Well, just like take two rubies off. It's not a big deal. Pennies are equi equivalent to rubies, even though you don't know what that is. But anyway, just like let's look for like two rubies. Seventy-nine. Was that enough to buy the the um wallet? I wasn't listening. Maybe it is. Let's go back and check. No, I'm not gonna go back and check. Because, you know in Zelda games, that all of the shop items have to be an even number. So it must be 80. Ah! Oh my lord. 
Wait, why did I just say all the Zelda, the shop items are even numbers? I don't even know that. Okay, who cares? Oh, okay, you know what? I'll see you guys in a little bit. Before I go, um, just suck this stuff up. And later on, it will be a shop here. If you suck all that stuff up. I never even used it before. I might use it for this Let's Play. But I never even used it yet. So let's search for this ruby. Not you, but me. I'll see you guys soon. Oh yeah. Uh, before I go back to finding these... This one ruby that I need. Um, you can find keenstone pieces in the grass. That's it. And finally, I found it. I didn't even have to cut. Okay. So let's get this. Um, did I even explain this? So basically, you just check this. Holder of the sacred, sacred powers. We grant you the power of the wind. This just disappears. Hmm. Whoa, it blew up. Hey kid, look where that stone marker used to be. There's something strange, there's some strange symbol on the ground. Yes, of course, why this must be? Well, I haven't the fog is to be honest, hmm. So, uh, we'll learn about this later. I won't tell you now, I'll keep it a secret. Okay, I'll see you guys back in the shop. Okay, so we're gonna get this wallet. We don't need to hear you talk. And we buy it. We spend all our money to buy a wallet. Something we need to hold more money in. You spend money on something we need to hold more money in. Isn't that very nice? Yeah, it is. Okay. So now, I gotta tell you a story. And it's like a short story. Uh, the first time and the second time I played this game, I didn't know where to go like at all because there's this these guards blocking it everywhere like everywhere except the front gate ah oh, there's another one of these things that we saw yep yep it scares him yeah because you're a scaredy cat anyway yep they're blocking all three sides i don't know why they didn't give you a hint but basically, you gotta just show this dude a spin attack. If we show it in front of him, nothing happens. But we gotta talk to this dude. I don't know why. Ho, ho, so you learned to spin attack? Bro, we didn't even talk. But I mean, I, I just did it right now. But if you don't ask him, I mean, if you don't do it, then, like, he still acts it anyway. But, ho, ho, so you learned to spin attack. It's still dangerous, but maybe you can handle it. Well, let's see how you do. Show me that spin attack. So, for some reason, power flows through this blade because we're holding it. And I, I guess he wants to watch too. Ah, what is he doing? What are you doing? Okay. Um, basically, you do this. Yeah, that's the one. But there are monsters out there. Okay, you just make sure you're careful. What is he doing, bro? Is he trying to teabag me or something? Anyway, you just make sure you're careful. And now we can go on to Pribby Highlands. But you know what? I'm going to just stop here. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you subscribe and like and support me even further. I got better from the last video. And yeah. See you later. Peace out.